we just came back from uh, breakfast, right? Breakfast is in the morning. <laughs> uh, we went to the diner and we got pancakes and eggs and all that fun stuff because we haven't been in a while. And it's gonna be the one of the last times that we're gonna be able to go to the diner that's right by us, which is kind of sad. We have officially two weeks from the day that we moved. Yes, I have an Ipsy bag. Ipsy bag's supposed to be coming today. Birch box is coming as well. We don't have toys coming off. That's just because I want to organize the toys tomorrow. But yeah, I'm just, I'm super excited to get things rolling. Let's see, the bathrooms are done. Clothes are done. Dom just did his clothes today. He didn't do them in a week like I thought he was going to. Um, we're going to do the cars and the garage on the weekend. And then I'm hopefully gonna get through all the toys tomorrow. Hopefully we're gonna go through them. Basically, if anything is missing something, if a book is missing papers, um, it's getting thrown. It's getting tossed because we're not, I'm not gonna bring all these toys to New Jersey when half of them are missing. It's just not gonna happen. So yes, that's the rules for tomorrow. And the kids are just running around in their pajamas because I'm, it's, it's a relaxed day. We're gonna pretty much take a mostly chilled out day today. I have do have I do have chow lunch with one of my friends on base, so I'm gonna go do that later on and just kind of enjoy ourselves today and just kind of get out of the whole moving, declutter, hectedness that's going on right now. It is that time of month where I get my subscription boxes in and my Ipsy and my Birch box came at the same time. So I'm just going to unbox both of them for you and let's see what we've got inside. First, we're going to do the Ipsy one. Let's see, let's open this up. Ooh, it looks like a little ticket. That's actually really cute. I think we're gonna, I can keep this in the car and put our like ticket stubs or something in it as like a memorabilia kind of thing. Or maybe just our gift cards. And now there's tons of clicking in the background noise. Of this video. Thank you, Dominic. Hmm? There's tons of clicking in the. Sorry. Let me just quietly type on my mechanical keyboard. <laughs> but I'm gonna see what we have inside of this here. The first thing I'm seeing is actually bubble wrapped. I'm gonna open this bubble wrap up, and this is a bamboo bronzer uh, in the color Palm Island by. Yate London. I am really bad at um, names, so I'll have to make pictures for you guys. Oh, that's a that's more of like a highlight for me. This is super light. I don't know if this is even gonna act as a bronzer for me. Actually, this might be good for my sister. She's a lot paler than I am, so um, Danielle, this is probably gonna be coming to you. The next thing that we have in here is a, looks like a, um, it's called a pigment. Oh no, it says highlight number 03 by Mika Beauty Cosmetics. It is just a regular, actually it's kind of like the same color as the bronzer. Uh, except this one just has sparkles and shimmers in it. Um, this I'll probably keep around just for like the summertime because this wouldn't be a bad color for a highlight for me. The next thing that's in here is the Hey Honey Bissome Mucho Shea Butter and Polis Lip Balm. It says for dry and chapped lips. I don't know if there's an act. It says kiss me generously. That's what Bissome Mucho means. So I don't know if this is color. It looks like it might have, a, oh no, it's not. It's just a, um, just a lip balm, which is actually, it smells really nice. It smells like vanilla and it's really soft. It feels really soft on my, on my hand here. So I'm probably gonna like this a lot. The next thing in here is the Hanalei Soothing Aloe Gel for face and body. Um, this is going to be nice because we're probably going to go into the pool for a couple of times before we leave here in California. And I know Nico is probably going to get sunburned at some point because he burns really easily, whereas Miranda doesn't, even with, uh, what's it called, suntan lotion. So he'll probably enjoy this. 
The last thing in here is a makeup brush and this is super cute. Oh my gosh, this is bringing me back to my like middle school days. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe this. It is a Lisa Frank uh, contour brush. Oh my gosh. And it's so soft. Oh my gosh, it's so soft. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh. It's got these little unicorns on it, which was my favorite character or, you know, animal that she would do. And it says XOXO Lisa Frank. It says Glamour Dolls. Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm in heaven. I don't think I'm ever going to use this because it's so pretty. But this just made my day. <laughs> it really did. This is going to go probably on my vanity and just never be touched with a couple other brushes that I love dearly. That is all that I got in the Ipsy bag. So now it is time to unbox the Birch Box. Stick in the side. That's what the cover looks like. And ooh, I already see some stuff in here that I've already had. <laughs> this is kind of a little disappointing. But I see some stuff in here also that I haven't gotten yet. So just what it looks like right away I'm getting like an herbal scent in here. So this is the Bombshell Blowout Spray. I'm pretty sure this I have had before. Um, no, this is not the one that I had before. Um, it just looks a lot like something else. It says protect, texturize, volumize, and repair for all hair types. It smells really good. I'm probably going to keep this with me. I'll use this when I get to Jersey. This is the stuff I've definitely had before. This is the sugar texturizing spray. Probably going to send this to my sister because I already have tons of texture in my hair. I really don't need um, a texturizing spray. And I remember using this and I didn't really like it too much. So I'll send this to my sister. This is the Deep Sleep Pillow Spray from This Works. And I think this is what I'm smelling. It's just a pillow spray. Yes, this is what I'm this is what I'm smelling. And it's so relaxing, like the scent of this. Dom is probably not gonna like this, so I'll just spray it on my pillow and not his. Mm -hmm. It's a pillow spray. Like that. that herbal scent that you smell. Like you spray it on my pillow? Yeah, you spray it on your pillow so it helps you relax at night. You should probably just not spray it on my pillow. Yeah. I'm not going to spray it on your pillow. This is the blue green algae antibacterial toner. So we haven't gotten toners in a while through a birch box. So this kind of smells really herbally. So I don't know if my skin's going to like it. My skin's on the sensitive side. It says anti-inflammatory and antibacterial eliminates oil and purifies to cool and refresh blemish prone skin. So my face is blemish prone, so to speak, just because of my T zone, but it's more of a hormonal thing than it is a, like my face is oily kind of thing. But I'll give it a try, but I can already tell that this is gonna, this is gonna react to my skin in a bad way, but I'll try it out anyway. The last thing that is in here is the double lip. They're real, um, I think this is the, I think it's a plump, a lip plumper. It says filler looking lips, one easy step. And it's just a little bottle here. Okay, so it's actually, huh, that is interesting. Oh, there we go. It looks like it's a two-toned lipstick in the color Lusty Rose and beyond sexy hmm it's a lipstick and liner in one that's what they're calling it it's very interesting to me so we'll see how this works that's all i got in my ipsy and my birch box and if you received any of these subscriptions uh leave a comment down below let me know what you guys have gotten in yours and we will see you next month with another um, uh, another reveal. Just finished cleaning both crates, Zim's crates over there, and washed both dogs. <laughs> and they're just running around the house like crazy. Of course, now they slow down a bit, but they were just running through here like the butt was on fire. <laughs>
but I just let him run around, get some water, play for a little bit, even though it is technically quiet time, but that's okay. Hopefully the kids and everybody will sleep in a little bit longer tonight. But I just always feel better when the dogs are finally bathed. I'm just waiting for them to calm down and like settle down so that I can go take a shower and clean the bathroom. Because if you have dogs and you wash them in the bathroom, then you know what a mess that can be, especially with a big dog. Zim kind of it's just easy. I can actually bring the towel into the shower and like, you know, uh, not wash her down, uh, dry her down. But Valid, she just, she's dopey and our bathtub's not big enough for her. So I pretty much have enough room to get in there with her and kind of like wash her up and then get her out. And then I have to dry her, which of course wets the whole entire bathroom. So I'm waiting for them to go down so that I can clean the bathroom and take a shower myself. And then hopefully put these two to bed. We have all of these bags here for donations. There's just so many. And I'm editing the vlog for you guys. Dom is reading because it's Tuesday and the kids are finally having quiet time on the couch. Never mind. Nico's right there. You <laughs> This is his little thing that he loves to do. He loves to get his, his blanket wrapped around him like that. He's the cutest thing ever. He really is. He's been melting my heart lately. But I am going to get this uploaded for you guys and then get to bed. I was planning on taking a shower, but then I remembered that I have a cardio workout tomorrow morning, so I'm like, eh. I'm going to just shower tomorrow. So I'm going to wash my face, brush my teeth, and then I'm going to go to bed. And I want to say welcome to the new subscribers. Welcome to the crew. If you're not part of the crew already, to subscribe down below, just click it. It's right there. If you've enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and you'll see See you tomorrow, guys. Thank you, you for watching. Good night. These crazy kids here. They're nursing Iron Man back to health. Well, he's, he's under here. Aw, look 